Travis Danrash at TIFF2011 for Red Carpet Diary. You can follow us on Twitter at Red Carpet Diary or like us on Facebook for all the latest updates. Up next on Red Carpet Diary, our Fariel Najim is at the premiere of The Hunter, the story of man versus beast, nature, and himself. Willem Dafoe stars as Martin, a man hired to track and kill an exotic wild animal in the hills of Tasmania. But when the animal, long thought to be extinct, proves difficult to track, Martin begins to question his purpose. This is an important job. You're looking for something most believe is extinct. Good Lord. Good Lord indeed, Mr. David. There's no room for mistakes. So don't make it. I heard one once, 50 years ago, but I still remember it. It's probably better off extinct. When it's alive, people will always want to hunt it down. Willem was a real pleasure to work with, and he made my job so much easier. Um, he completely you know, understood the character. He worked really hard to get, it, get the character right. To prepare for the role, I had to learn how to do lots of things. And when you learn new things, it always puts your head in a different place. And, and you see a different way. He was very particular about his props. He had to have the right knife. Willem Dafoe, he attracted me. He's a very attractive man and, uh, and a great story. They say that in Tasmania you can get four seasons in any one hour uh, and we frequently did. We had snow, rain, fog, hail and leeches. Um, yeah, Willem was a big fan of the leeches. He liked that a lot. And the challenge is, I don't know, just to be uh, graceful and purposeful. I mean, uh, those are things that I enjoy real lo uh, a lot, uh, being out in the nature and doing real things. It's, uh, it was a pleasure. There's some powerful messages in this film. What do you hope the audience takes away from this story? Look, I hope they just enjoy a really compelling mystery story um, uh, set in an amazing backdrop, you know, with some, some spectacular scenery. It should be two hours of entertainment. And are there any films here at TIFF that you're looking forward to seeing? I'm leaving at 6 in the morning, I have no chance to see anything else. Damn it!